TFNN. Headline News Update. Hi, everyone. Basil Chapman. This is the uh, Tiger Noon Update. I am the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour coming up straight after this update. Dow is down 122. A big part of it is Boeing down 19 points, um, 26,301. This is a good chance for the Dow to have a little bit of a breather. Some of the, some of the indexes you'll see as we move along, uh, the S&P is a little bit better. It's down five at 2887. Uh, there's a good chance it's just taking a bit of a breather. I think the next couple of days could see uh, some weakness in the market. I'm not looking for anything too deep, but I would expect some kind of a pullback. But there's a rotational aspect. So there are a couple of stocks like the QQQ could be held by some of the stocks. It's sitting right at the 184.50 level. It made a high of 84.92 just four days ago. It's been struggling, making a little bit of a rectangle formation. I'll put it right in there. And what we are looking at is uh, right there. We're looking at support at the 182 level is going to be very important this week. And there should be quite strong resistance in the 185s. Uh, the IWM, which has been lately, it's been the stronger of the indices, having a bit of a rest here, down 56 cents at 156.82. And here as well, 155.50 would be the support. 158, a strong resistance in the 158. Let's go to gold, because gold had a really nice move up early this morning. It's up now at 6 at 13.01, but it had gone all the way to the 13, I believe it was 13.10 area. I'm sorry, 13.07, 13.07 area. Yep, 13.07. Uh, so this is a bit of a pullback, but it's still holding very well. If you look at the dollar, the dollar is taking a bit of a breather after a really good week. And uh, it's down 32 cents or 32 ticks at 97.08. I suspect it's still going to go for this 97.60s uh, over the next uh, week, maybe even a little bit higher. But it must hold 96.80 on a short term basis. And you've got crude oil. <laughs> crude oil has been really on a tear. It's up a dollar ten and sixty four eighteen. It's gone above that sixty uh, three twenty five area. I said it should be resistance. It's higher than that. Now it's making the weekly two hundred period exponential moving average at sixty four. Let me just give you that right there. Sixty six. Yeah, sixty six eighty would be the target. Uh, I'll be back straight after this. Do my show, the Tiger Editions Hour. Otherwise, have a great day. See you tomorrow.